So um, I just feel like I should quickly talk about something. You know, since um, last week, last two weeks, it has been trending on social media. Justice for Uwa, justice for Tina, justice for Jennifer, and justice for every girl, every woman that has ever been raped. And then it's funny how you see some people making the rape victims to be the guilty ones like they'll be saying things like why did she go to that place why does she dress in a certain type of way why was she like this why was she like that and i personally i am of the opinion that there is no justification for rape in no circumstances is the rape victim guilty of rape the only person that is guilty of rape is the rapist now the reason why I'm saying this is because I got I posted something on my um, um, Instagram page uni at Unique Block, and then it was talking about a, a lady who told her husband of how she was raped in her previous years, and then the husband blamed her for being raped, and because of that, she's seeking for a divorce. And a friend of mine chatted me up, and he was narrating a story of where when ladies will will like you're making out with a guy and you will be saying no when you actually mean yes and then when the guy stops like he stops touching you because you said no you go home and then you start texting him and saying you should have tried harder you should have forced me i said no didn't mean that i meant no like what the what the hell is what does that mean ladies and i tr i believe him because i know i've heard it a lot of times that there are some ladies that do stuff like that if you say if you mean no if you say no, make sure you mean no. Don't come back and start saying why didn't you force me? Why didn't you why did you give up easily? Statements like this are the things that will make this type of guy start feeling like maybe next time if a guy if a lady says no to me, she actually means yes. And maybe in that case, that particular lady actually means no. So we need to be we need to be matured. We need to know how to do this. And these ladies, when you ask them, they tell you because they feel like if they don't say no, it makes them cheap. Come on. If you're old enough to have sex, nothing makes you cheap. If you want to have sex with someone, go ahead and do it. If you don't want to have sex with someone, let them know you don't want to have sex with them. Don't be saying no when you mean yes. And then for the, like, I'm not saying this to justify anything, not at all. I'm just trying to make a point. Now, for those guys that feel like maybe, okay, the way I'm dressed now, I'm wearing off shit, and then somebody will see me and feel like I start sexualizing me, or maybe even if I put this down a little bit downward, and then you start sexualizing me, or maybe I wear a bikini and you start sexualizing me, you are mental. You have no, there is no justification for it. Even if I walk around completely naked, I even if I walk around completely naked, it gives you no right. It gives no man any right to rape a woman. Okay, um, two days ago, I saw a post on Facebook of a little baby. The baby should be like maximum three years old, putting on like a crop top and a ripped jeans. And then a guy posted this picture and he was like, okay, look at how you dress this baby. And then you blame men for raping them. Like, what the hell? What the hell? How do you sexualize a baby? Even if that baby wears only panties and walk around, what gives you the right to rape her? There is no, oh my God. I really, there is no justification for rape. On no circumstances should any woman be raped. Do you know why? Because when you rape a, a girl, a baby, a lady, to you, it is just 5 minutes, 10 minutes, 30 minutes, or 1 hour of pleasure. But to this rape victim, it is a trauma that is going to last them for a lifetime. I've seen a lot of lives being ruined because they were raped. A lot of ladies being affected mentally because they were raped when they were kids. Even as adults, because they were raped, it affects them sexually, it affects them mentally, it affects them emotionally, it affects them psychologically. To you, it is just a few minutes of pleasure. But to those women, it is a lifetime of ruin. On no account should you rape anybody. Come on, if you feel like having sex. There are a lot of girls out there ready to have sex with you. If you don't find anyone, go ahead and, and, and pay the prostitute. I am not a fan of prostitution or whatsoever, but... These people are willingly doing it for the money. Why not go to them? Why why we in a life? Why we in a life? Please, let's say no to rape. Let's stop this. Let's 